that was really unnecessary, but welcome back to a new but welcome back to a brand new video guys. Before we start this video, if you are a loyal subscriber, make sure you smash the thumbs up right away. If you're not a loyal subscriber, wait to the end before you decide if you enjoy the video or not. But anyway, today, once again, it might not apply to some people this video because it's not riding. Because once again, if you've watched the Hot Knife video, this is the same day. So it's freezing cold outside, can't go out, nothing to do, but I still want to keep you guys entertained with some content. So, without further ado, this is a setup that I'm going to be running in Barcelona. As you know, if you're loyal, once again, if you're up to date on my Instagram, my Snapchat, my Insta stories, you'll know that I'm going to Barcelona from the 16th till the 21st of January, which is, today is, today is the 11th, so six days I'll be in Barcelona. I'm not sure when this video might be up, I might save it until the, till that week, but we never know. You see this when you see it. A lot of you guys wanted to see a custom build of this setup as it's a super ultra light setup for someone like me. So I recommend this setup for anyone who is over the age of 14 um, because if you're under that age I can guarantee you can go for something much lighter. But if you want something with a bit more bulk and strength uh, that's more trustworthy and you're about over 5 foot and in between the ages of oh, over 14 this is the perfect setup for you. Um, but anyway, I'm going to go through the parts right now. Rather than showcasing them the way they are, I'm going to show images on the screen because obviously you guys want to see these parts brand new. You don't want to see them in this condition. I mean, there's, these parts are used. They've been lasting me for a long time already, apart from the deck. I got that the other day. Um, and the forks. But you, want, you guys want to see these fresh. I'm going to leave all the links to every single part I have right here in the description below. And I'll also leave recommendations if you want to go for something else, like for example lighter wheels, lighter bars, I can't, you can't get light of this, a bulkier deck. So I'm leaving the screenshots on screen of what they look like fresh. But anyway guys, without further ado, let's just get straight into it. So I'm going to start closest to me, we're going to go the Sacrifice SES, the Recon SES, 4 bolt clamp, this one is in matte black. Once again, if you want to go for something lighter, you can go for an ICS, and that also requires a lighter force as well. So I'll leave the other clamp on screen right now. So this is the lighter option, which you have to run with these forks I'm about to show you right now. So if you want to run that, you can. Once again, I prefer SES because it adds a little bit more weight onto the front, and then therefore you can feel whips come around on that. Moving on, we've got a pair of Sacrifice blenders, the non-high wall versions. They're no different to be honest, I just these are the only ones I have in black on black. But uh, once again, on the inside of these we've got roller coaster sacrifice bearings. Once again, these are lasting me nearly over four months now. No rolling water. Oh, guys, don't ride in water on your bearings. Just don't, because it ruins them. These ones are fresh, I've been riding these for ages. Moving on, the Neochrome Sacrifice Fork. This is the Bionic. So this one is for SCS, I believe. Uh, like I said earlier, you can go for the much lighter option, uh, which you saw, which you saw earlier. Moving on, I'm going to tell you guys a little life hack. I'm running a Sacrifice Hyper headset, uh, but rather than using, because I'm quite lanky and I want to have my bars slightly bit taller than the original height of the bars, rather than adding three of these ugly mother um, to make it look more blended in with the deck, I've actually added three top caps. You'll see what that looks like in the end. At the end when I showcase the actual scooter when it's fully built. You'll notice that it looks a lot nicer than it does with just three spaces. It actually fits with the deck bar. Moving on. Sacrifice aluminium bars. These are the same ones in the last custom build. If you haven't seen that one, go check it out. I'll leave it in the cards in the top right. But um, this, these are the exact same bars. Not bent, not cracked, still fresh. Also running the exact same grips. The Sacrifice S grips, super soft, no wear whatsoever, still super soft and grippy as well. Good thing about these grips, if you noticed, on the ends, they're actually like rounded downwards. So they're not like squared off at the ends, so it just feels a lot better. If you ride ODIs, you'll notice the difference. Look, this, this is just so much better. In my opinion, it just feels nicer. There's much more I can say about that. Put them down. But yeah, once again, if you want to go for the heavier and more bulkier option, 
You can go either with the Tritons, we can go with the Rios, we can go with the Steel versions or the Cromoly uh, versions of these bars. But yeah, I'll leave them in the description as well. That's if you want to go for like more stronger bars. But once again, these do last a while if you're a clean rider. Moving up, the nicest part, I believe, the Sacrifice Neochrome AK-110. You can also get the bulkier head tube version, which has a lot stronger head tube, which is also the same weight. The reason I don't have the Akashi in Neochrome is because the um, Sacrifice didn't have any in stock because they've all sold out everywhere, like literally. Them decks are gone so fast that the distributors cannot send them in. So I've got this one, but to be honest, I don't mind. They're both the same to me, except I know the Akashi has got a lot stronger head tube, but, but for me, this head tube is trusty. So once again, I've never snapped one of these decks, and they're just brilliant, super lightweight decks. If you go on Sacrifice's website, I'll tell you all the weights and all the information about the deck, the sizes and all that. So I'm not going to spend all day talking to you about that. And once again, on the back of this deck, I am running the Sacrifice Break. I don't know which one it's called, but it's black, and it's metal, it has two bolts. It's just a break, to be honest, that's all I care about. And my alarm was just gone. So my headset just fell out. Anyway, I'll pop the headset back in. Nicely in. Yeah, that's a sacrifice Neochrome. Like I said, if you want to go for the bulky version, go for the Akashi. It has a bigger head tube and it has more strength inside there. Oh yeah, repping the shop sponsors. Dog Scooters, thank you for this grip tape. This is the Dog Scooter grip tape. If it is out, I haven't actually researched it yet, but um, I'm not sure if it's out yet, but if it is out, I'll leave that in the description. But this grip tape, I've put it on straight away and it's still the same as it was when I first got it. You can go and check out Dog Scooters in the description if you want to buy any of your sacrifice parts. They are actually stocking so much at the moment guys, Dog Scooters are. So if you want to go and buy some parts, go and check them out. Anyway guys, I think that is pretty much everything that I am running when I go to Barcelona and after Barcelona. This is a super lightweight setup once again for someone that's my age, my size, my build. And once again, I do want to aim at everybody so if you do want to get heavier parts or more bulkier parts, I will leave them down below as well. Just have a good read of the description and then you might understand. It's kind of hard to explain it all in the video. But apart from that, I'm going to film a time lapse of me building the skewer and then I'm going to give a good showcase afterwards, close up of everything, of the way it is. So, let's get it! <laughs> People are wondering if it's dialed or not. I know it. The answer to your question is. Yes, very dialed. So there you guys have it. That's my setup that I'm running for Barcelona. If you did enjoy this video, please be sure to smash the like button on this one guys. Even if you don't like it, or you didn't really enjoy it that much that I don't deserve a like, just do because it's a really nice gesture and it really makes me want to make me do more videos. So if you can do that, that would really mean a lot to me. And also, if you're brand new to the channel, I do a lot more stuff than just custom builds. I do edits, we do web vlogs, etc. Just go and check out the channel guys. If you're new to the channel, be sure to subscribe. More lit content coming soon. Barcelona is going to be absolutely insane. Stay tuned for that. I think that's pretty much it, guys. Check out the description if you want any of these parts. And uh, I can now put my curtain back up.
But yeah, guys, check out some of the playlists. On... But yeah, got. But yeah, guys, be sure to check out some of the other playlists. That's all I gotta say. Peace out. <laughs>